Hey guys. One I am one nine here. The most lazy gaming channel you have ever seen. First of all, I am sorry to disappoint you, since this is not a gaming video, but it is a video for my university project instead. This video is about entity relationship diagram or ERD for short. This ERD is for math quiz. Let's begin. First, the player table consists of player ID, as primary key, player name, and player password. Since my project does not allow me to key in any sort of primary key into the system, the player name will be unique, as it is required to sign in using their own account. After the player has signed in, they will answer a series of question set, which we got a table over here. This table here consists of set ID, as the primary key and set name. The reason I created a table for question sets is to key in the score for players, after they are finished answering the questions. The score is keyed in into the player set score that consists of set score ID, as primary key, player name that is referenced to the player's player name, set name that is referenced to question sets set name and set score. The score is also updated to the player total score to make it easier to display another set of scores. It is the same as player set score table, but I used player total score ID as the primary key and the player total score. That's all for table. Now let's talk about relationship. For relationship between player and player set score, one player can have at least one set score. Meanwhile one set score can only hold one player's data only. Same goes to player and player total score relationship. For question set and score, question can have at least one score meanwhile one set score only have one set. That is all about math quizzes ERD thanks for watching.